Welcome to Chess, ladies and gentlemen. Maligi Young Pak died inside my chest, ladies and gentlemen. I appreciate you guys very much for stopping by. Um, as I did say before, uh, I am doing, uh, I am playing bullets on leechess.org. Uh, and uh, I did hit a high yesterday of 2305. As you can see, I'm at 2251 uh, right now. So I'm a little bit behind that. But uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get a couple of games rolling. Uh, like I said before, I'm going to try as best I can to do commentary during the game. These are 60 second games, so they're really fast. So it's, you know, it's a little hard to kind of go through all your thoughts while you're playing the game. Uh, but I'm going to do my best to kind of try to go through my thought process and what I'm trying to see. Uh, and, uh, yeah. So if you guys are ready to go, um, let me go ahead and get a game rolling. Let's seek one out. See, see what we can't, who we can't play. Hold on. I'm going to fix this because I'm going to play. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's see what this person as black is gonna do. So we're doing. Uh, so we got a queen. Got a got a Catalan like Queen's Indian type situation going on. Play d five. There we go. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and do that. Rookie one. E four is coming. Let's put some. Uh, that's fine. Rook to d1. Queen is on some on some trappage a little bit. Let's go here. That's gonna be annoying though, because he has knight takes e4. Let's just sack a queen. <laughs> just because. Let's just do that. And then we have we have some nice uh, minor pieces. He's thinking about it. I'm gonna do it. Just just because. Uh okay. Uh, let's just go ahead and do that because he is actually putting himself in a pin if he takes on e4 with the knight yeah so the knight is actually in well no not actually no okay so it's not in a pin this is kind of annoying I'm gonna just do this because I did trap my queen there that's a little bit annoying a little bit annoying Oh, let's do that. I think we might win on time. This is actually not too like insanely horrible of a position for um for white. Okay. Let's do that. This is this is really whack. Okay. Let's move rook up. He's gonna go queen b5. Let's just do that. Okay. You know how I do. Oh, this is annoying. Let me just threaten that. H4. Three. Okay, so I'm winning on time, maybe. And he dropped his queen. <laughs> all right, so I was doing all right in there, man. Let me see. Backing up. I mean, normally you don't take with you don't take knight. The knight doesn't take d5 in this position. <clears throat> it is worse than pawn takes. Um, I'm pretty sure. Let me see here. I think you just go e4. Is it just e4? No, because let me see. You got this knight takes pawn takes, and then you drop in the pawn. So maybe it's just a rook to e1, queen to c2 type situation going on. E4 is very preferable uh, in these in these types of positions uh, to play E4, uh, but it has to come with the tempo because, uh, like I said, knight takes here, pawn takes, and then a bishop takes. Uh, if the knight retreats back, you can play rook to E1, but I don't know. I get kind of I got kind of stuck in that position. But let's I mean it's a win, it's enough. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get another. We got a, a fide master rolling real quick. Uh, let me see. Let's trade, queen trade, knight here. We got a little couple threats going on. Let me see. Uh, I can't play bishop c5 yet. But I can play it now. <laughs> Gonna push b5, get that knight out of there. Oh. Or just drop a pawn. <laughs> I guess I guess we can just win a bishop. Yeah, that's unfortunate he did that. But that's bullet, man. That is bullets. We will take that. So that is 2263. 
Uh, I don't know what he was doing with that bishop move. It, this is, I mean, it gets kind of complicated when people play like the queen swap type stuff because it's not like super normal to play that. But uh, let me see. I think I was good. I mean, maybe knight b to d7, protecting the pawn, not just dropping it straight out. But yeah, he just completely just got blind with this one here. And I mean, his king is in the center and stuff like that. I'm going to start developing my pieces. I do have a pin here. So I can play knight to d5. So let's see, uh, let's see what else we got over here. I might make a video where I got three or four straight wins. 23-34. He left the game. Don't accept challenges from somebody. Uh, you know, just play the game if you accept the challenge, man. I mean, you can always put like a certain rating range if you want to. So we're going to go uh, Carol Connor real quick. Bishop here. Yep, and he's going to do that. I don't really notice this theory on this. So this is a little bit annoying. Let's just go here. Castles. Get into safety. Bishop e6. Let's go rook to e8. Got a rook on c8. Let's, let's go here because we can actually tickle this pawn back here. Which he defends. But we're going to knock the knight anyway. Maybe. I don't want to give up my bishop. Let's go here. Because bishop knight to b5 isn't a problem. Because we're just we'll, we'll just give up the bishop in this position. Uh, man, let's just do that. This is kind of annoying when they pin it like that. But I'm gonna go h6, knock that bishop away, because we can mess his structure up over here if he retreats. Yes, I mean you kind of have to trade here, man. No. Okay. Let's trade here. Go here. That's something. That is... Oh, it's not hanging a rook. If the bishop takes, he's hanging his rook. Ah! He's too He's too smart for that. Alright. We'll trade off here. Queen. Bishop here to e2. Uh... Go ahead and trade here. Rook takes. Queen here. Is that okay? That's not hanging a mate. Let's do that. Because he does, but I have I have blocking with the bishop. I can block with the bishop. You gotta do something. Check. Queen back here or bishop back here. Let's do this. Cause I I am protecting with my queen. Let's go here. Uh, come back. Yeah. All right. We got time. <laughs> we got time. That was kind of rough. I mean, let me see. Three, six. Everything's pretty much equal, man. I mean, he does have the double bishop, so maybe he's like a touch better, but yeah. I feel like I was kind of getting a little edge there, but as you guys can see, it's really hard for, really hard for me to try to, uh, try to, uh, you know, give commentary and stuff while I'm playing because it's just, everything is going so fast, but I'm going to pop one more game in there. And see if I can't get get a 4-0 score. Uh, we got a Slav. I know somebody out there that's going to like this. We got Knight to F3. Let's see. Bishop G4. Bishop F5. Okay. Pawn takes. Don't take with the Knight. And I go Queen here. I'll, I'll go here anyway. Pawn takes. You got issues on B6. Let's go here. Rook over to D1. I got A4 coming. Where are you going? Are you going back? Okay, so we got pawn here. <clears throat> Let's move the bishop back. We have a little attack on this knight here. I'm not worried about that. Then we castle. Let's go knight down to d2. Protect, double protect this pawn. This knight or this bishop is uh, uh, threatening that. So let's go f3, just secure our structure. And then knight is going to be coming down to a2. And we're going to be trading. and the, That's fine. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm not worried about that. So let's back the bishop up. And then we have... Um, let's go knight here. Okay, we just trade. That's fine. Let's push pawn. Where's the knight going? It's going there. Okay, that's fine. We can just keep pushing pawns. Back the bishop up. 
What you got? What you got? Uh, I don't want to trade. I don't want to trade. That's annoying. I don't like this. Let's go here. Oh, he's going to get a like a tempo on me. That's fine. Okay, we do that. I'll, I'll get out of that murkiness. Yeah. He got one, but I got another one. Okay, that's not really anything. Okay. Let's go. Okay, I'll trade because I don't have any time. <laughs> got him. All right. Yeah, I was down. I mean, he got, yeah, I'm down a piece. It, it got kind of, it got kind of iffy in this spot right here. Like once he went, this is a really nice move. That's a real, this is a really nice move, Bishop C2. I shouldn't have moved my knight. I should have just left it alone and went ahead and just pushed B C F5. And then the bishop is literally coming back to H7 and it's going to have a horrible life. Uh, but I didn't do that. Let me get my, my camera back right. What's going on with the camera right here, man? Good. Uh, but yeah, uh, I appreciate you guys for coming by. Uh, let me see. I am at 2274. So I'm not doing too bad. I'm still pretty much in the same like little area that I was before. So this was a much better video. Uh, so um, yeah, maybe at some point in the future, I'll play some Blitz. And then I can actually go through a little bit of a better thought process. But like I said, I mean, move, making these moves so fast, you can't really complete your thoughts and stuff like that. So it's kind of it's kind of crazy. As you guys can see, playing these players is really hard. I don't know what level you guys are at, but in this level of playing between, let's say, 22 and 2400-ish, they're pretty rough. They are pretty rough. And 